Well, if you are just joining us, thanks so much for being here. Time to get you caught up on our headlines. Here are your headlines in 90 seconds. Cincinnati's only abortion clinic could be forced to close because it doesn't comply with the state law. Since the clinic filed a federal lawsuit on Monday, we did some digging and found out that the state law requires every clinic in the Buckeye State to have a partnership with a private hospital. The only thing, the only private hospitals in our community are religious based. This creates a big problem for the Planned Parenthood Clinic in Mount Auburn. Our Bryce Onslinger spoke earlier with experts on this issue, and you can watch his story in case you missed it on WCPO.com. We will continue to follow this case and bring you updates. A grand jury will soon decide if a Brown County Courthouse employee will face charges after deputies found dozens of marijuana plants growing on her property. Barbie McElroy is the assignment commissioner for Common Pleas Judge Scott Guzweiler. Back on September 9th, police found 16 pounds of marijuana inside and around her house. Jason Law will have more on that investigation coming up at 6 on 9 on Your Side. And a Redding teen who police say smothered his baby sister to death will not be tried as an adult. The surprise move happening this morning. Now, because the case is staying in the juvenile court system, he'll likely not spend the rest of his life in prison. The 14-year-old went before a judge today but did not speak. When he was arrested over the summer, he told investigators that voices inside his head told him to smother his baby sister with a pillow. And that's a look at your headlines in 90 seconds.